in the fuck? I, I, I would show the video, but one, I think my video will get taken down if I show it. Two, it's honestly fucking disgusting. I like, I struggled to get through it the first time. I didn't even know if I wanted to make a video on this because, I mean, it, some things are just so, rep, what is it, reprehensive? Apprehensive. Reprehensive? I don't fucking know. Some things are just so f disgusting and shitty, it's like, wh what else do I say? Like, what the fuck? I don't even think that, yeah, I don't think she's, she's gonna get any type of major repercussions, I would be surprised if she did. If, I mean, I could be wrong. I would sure. I hope I'm wrong. Shit, but I don't think that she is. You see, if this was a man that said this shit, oh. yeah. Okay. Sorry, I never stated who I was talking about, but I'm talking about this disgusting piece of shit. Um, the human feces, Peaches. She's some weirdo, um, obese woman, um, as I say in the video, who just acts fucking horrendously weird online. She's really disgusting, and I, when I think of her, I think of her name being next to the word stank in the dictionary. In fact, I think the word stank was invented and wake of her eventually coming to the earth and just stanking everything up. She's the type of girl that everyone in school calls big nasty because she's just so big and nasty. So, yeah, that's Peaches. That's who I'm talking about. Like, look, basically, I'm gonna paraphrase what she said because I'm not going to put the video in there. I, like, I, nah, I'm just not having that in my, and I don't have a software that can bleep stuff out. I would put it in there if it, if it could, if I could bleep, but. So basically, the code for, we're just gonna say tape instead of the R word. And yeah, so basically she says, she, she's saying, we're just gonna paraphrase. We're not even gonna try to go word for word. She's saying, somebody told me where Charlie D'Amelio, a 16 year old TikToker, is at. Because I got this fucking big black man to tape her. Replace the T with an R. Yeah, I, I, I got this big black man to tape her. So somebody send me her location so he can figure out where it's at. Now, I could only imagine. And, and then she has a guy on the phone like, yeah. Yeah, I, she, yeah, I'm, 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 mm. It's, 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 yeah, no. You see, if we're gonna cancel Shane Dawson, oh! and you guys do not get on this weird, obese, potato looking ass bitch, I've lost all hope. Cause how the fuck can you decide to go and cancel Shane Dawson for shit he said nine, ten years ago? That were a part of an era where he made, and everyone made, edgy jokes. I mean, for fuck's sake, even Jenna Marbles had to apologize for saying Ching Chong. Yeah, we, we already know. You guys are gonna cancel him for that shit. This bitch just said this in this era. This is her right now. There's no, oh, it was a joke. There's a... Dog. Even if it is a joke, at this point in time, you're direct, like, no, that's not even, like, they're, they're, that's not cool. That's not cool. It's fucked up shit, okay? It's fucked up shit. Maybe that is a part of her content. Maybe, maybe that, maybe she tells jokes. I, I mean, I don't know too much about Peaches. I know she's some pretty fucking edgy. I've seen some nasty stuff of her, like, she's walking around butt naked. Nobody wants to see that. But this is this is like not nah, okay. Like this is not that point in time, and I don't even think like it's not even a joke. Like it, it, the Shane Dawson shit really wasn't a joke. This is worse than the Shane Dawson shit. Okay, this is so much worse than the Shane Dawson shit. 
Like, at least there was a little bit of room for you, for you to see. Okay, I can see how he was joking with, with context and everything. With this, it's like, even even still, even with the context of the type of video she may make, because I've seen she she's really, she, she does some edgy stuff. I don't know too much about her, but I know she does some edgy stuff. Even with this, you calling, saying online, telling your people, give me this girl's information so I can get this man to tape her with an R in front. That, I, I'm sorry, it's it's not really even comparable to the Shane Dawson thing. It's much worse. This is much worse. This is basically like saying, yes, yeah, send me the location of this whatever person, even if they are underage, regardless, so I can kill them. It's like, dude, what? It's not even funny. And then imagine how Charlie D'Amelio feels. Dude, it, it, it's fucked. It's fucked. And apparently, like, she has, she was on some, like, I think, live streams of Charlie D'Amelio's and she's saying she wants to see Charlie get rammed from behind. It's like, come on. Like, it, that, I don't even think in that era back then, that's not, <laughs> that, that's not even how people would joke. I don't even think Shane Dawson would have done something like that because at least like the Shane Dawson thing, it was bad, okay? But, I'm gonna stop it right here. I made a really shitty point, so I'm just gonna skip past this. This was an awful point. Um, <laughs> I said he, basically I was saying how he got the girl included in the video, but dude, she was like a little fucking kid and it was just fucking weird. And then the Willow stuff, yes, the Shane Dawson shit was, was pretty fucked and I didn't make much of a good point here. But I, I still just think directly going on a girl's live and telling her how you want to see her get fucked and then posting on your own page how you're going to get this girl taped um i think it's much worse but obviously both are pretty fucked it's just equally fucked up man it's all fucked up okay you went on this group this underage girl's stream as a grown ass fucking elephant looking ass woman and you told her you want to see her get fucked from behind and then you're talking about she also said some shit about how she was horny and she was going to get her toy. On the live, like, it's not even like a skit or anything. Like, it, it, uh, fuck. Oh, oh, God. I don't even know what to say anymore. I don't, I don't know what to say. You know. Y'all y'all do your thing. I, I don't even want to ask for likes on this one. I, I don't want to ask for likes. I Yeah, I, I might lost for words. Like This shit is is legit fucking nuts. But yeah, y'all 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 do your thing. I hope y'all are having a good day. Uh rest in peace again to Khabib's father. Um I, I don't remember how to say his name. I'm sorry, guys. No disrespect to the man. Um, but I'd, I'd rather not mess up his name than, you know, mess up his name. But still, rest in peace to him. Y'all have a good rest of your day. Um, look, I I don't know if you can really do... I mean, you could maybe harassment or there's something like trying to sexually entice a minor or something like that. I'm sure there's some charges that can be dropped on it um but this bitch is fucking weird I, I hate even looking at her face bro i hate looking at her face like i don't even want to punch it like i just i just don't, don't even want to be near her she looks she stank you know but i wouldn't be mad if it, like if someone did punch her She's one of those women like I, I like I wouldn't feel bad if they got punched really fucking hard and got knocked the fuck out. Yeah, anyways, y'all y'all have a good one. I'm out.